Hello everyone, Chris Arsenault, Head Pro at Muni Lafayette, home of the Jay and Lionel A. Bear Brothers. I got my man, Mr. Ken Gerard. What can I say? I'm not gonna say anything. I'm gonna let you share whatever you wanna share. I, I've been wanting to do this, but this is where the history starts. This man knows it, so he's gonna tell it. Well, I mean, I'm not that old, but <laughs> uh, I started hanging around here when I was 11. My mom started uh, working for Lee Como when I was 11. And I hang around here all my life since then, except when I was in the military. And I came back and I worked for Paul Short for seven years, part time, while I was at the uh, post office. I've seen a lot of great golfers come through here. A lot of them, Jay and Lionel. I used to shag balls for Jay and Lionel. And uh, like I said, they, uh, Palmer and Nicholas played at Oakmorn when we had a pro tournament in Lafayette. They played, they both came here because they were contending for the money title that year. So Nicholas and Palmer played here? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Who sure. was this back in the what, 50s, 60s? Uh, let's see, yeah, I graduated in uh, 61. So it was before that, like I'd say 59, wow. maybe 60. Wow. I did have to look it up. So tell me what was your mom's uh, role here? I know I hear all the part that well, she the caddies was, here back in the day. Yeah, she was uh, more or less work behind the counter. Mm -hmm. And toward the end, when she actually got older, Paul had to work in the, uh, the register. Did she handle like the caddies? I mean, you know, kind of do Oh no, caddies. Jimmy Picard was the caddy master right. when I came. Uh, that was right before uh, Curly Romero had just left, and Jimmy was uh, Jimmy wound up head pro at Tamashana in uh, Detroit. Oh wow! Yeah, yeah, wow! Yeah, but he died. Yeah, but Nick I, I want to uh, before we close out, we're going to be doing this. This is phase one of uh, the history of Muni. You know we got to make them laugh about the uh, the elephants. Oh, Lord, Lord. <laughs> you gotta make them laugh about the Lord, elephants. Lord. Please give them that. <laughs> Tron Circus was in town, and the, everybody had left but the elephants. They had a, they, we had a bathroom on the other side of the uh, golf course, on the other side where the old train used to be. Remember the old yeah, train? I don't remember, but I. Oh, okay. Well, they time. had chained the elephants around the uh, bathroom and uh, they had one bull and he broke the chain oh my god and he took off he went down false scaring people that people outside hanging clothes como snowball stand they like to flip <laughs> they came he came on the course and he come uh, Andrews Begno was diving for balls when oh he saw him, boy. He, he jumped back at the ball. He jumped Jimmy, back at the ball. Jimmy Picard was, <laughs> was hitting practice balls. And he's going, Jimmy's chasing him to, so he don't step on his golf ball. Oh, my God. There's two guys uh, peeing off on 12. Oh, my God. But they, they, they saw him. <laughs> they jumped. Oh, <laughs> yeah, gone. They're gone. So, so you telling me there was a wild elephant bull running around the course? Well, he's supposed to be tame, <laughs> you know. I mean, he's in the circus. So anyway, the cops come, they pick up the trainer, and they go down Louisiana Avenue to number 13. Okay. Okay, the fence the wasn't there or nothing. He gets out that police car and got that hook. Okay. And he hit him under the, under the trunk. The blood would fly. And he, <laughs> Crap every time. <laughs> he, I mean, every time he'd hit him, he'd, he'd crap all over the place. Guys, y'all hear this? I'm telling you, I had to tell about this joke, man, about the other one. This is not a joke, it's serious. Oh, yeah, it's serious. So, Talk guys, listen, I want to close this off because this video is getting a little long, but I had to have Keith, uh, Kid Jerome, talk about it. And uh, we'll be back again. This is Chris. <laughs> And our man, Mr. Ken Gerard, I had to uh, add him, watching him around the golf course as a kid, saying, man, this is what I want to do. So, Mr. Gerard, congratulations on your hall. Oh, thank you. And you and many others, again, we're going to keep yeah. building this. Muni right. Legends Hall of Fame. Thank you, guys. Ken Gerard, Chris Arsenal. All right.